All right, guys, today we're going up to Randy Richards' place and we're going to do some machine work on an angle plate. How you doing, everybody? This is Randy Richard in the shop. I got uh, Chris Anderson here. He's uh, up here visiting. We've been uh, kind of working on a project for how long? Oh, uh, at least a year. At least a year. At least. A year. I don't know if we've really been working well, on it. But, uh, <laughs> trying to get something done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, Chris, you saw in his videos he made the patterns. Yeah. For these angle plates. Okay. See that. There we go. Uh, these are cast iron, and he, yeah. he's had them uh, cast. Yeah. From who? Uh, Sunset Ironworks or Sunset Foundry in Valley Springs. In Valley Springs, and that's yeah. in California, you guys. Just so you know. See that? <laughs> so, you finally are done, and you had just four. Yeah, four, I just made four. Four made. If anybody wants some? Let me know. <laughs> we can make more. So these are uh, five inches by six and a half anyway so these are really rough 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 <laughs> and uh, we just uh <clears throat> we just finished milling one uh to uh, the, the worst one right <laughs> yeah it was definitely the worst one little inclusion there and uh, we got some uh holidays back in here not too bad though yeah. we did the worst one just in case we really screwed this up <laughs> <laughs> Could always take this back and ask them for a new casting probably <laughs> yeah. but you saved the the you still have the pattern oh yeah yeah off, so yeah. uh you know. yeah the pattern should be good for a long time yeah so what's this about this uh it was it about? was three quarters of an inch uh yeah, oh, first yeah. but it shrank a little bit uh minimally you know yeah but you don't these, lose these, much these, on three these are all really, these these castings all came out really good yeah this is the only one that came end up with a couple holidays in it but we've milled this off right here these two sides and we've checked them on the plate and we're about seven tenths out of square in in the five inches must have been the quality and the pattern making yeah I think it, that... it's got to be the pattern i think so i think so <laughs> so so we're like really happy there <laughs> we couldn't believe that we got them that got it that square uh, uh, just by milling it, yeah, and, uh, stuff. So, uh, and and they're fairly flat. Uh, we, you know, run across a few tenths difference, but but yeah. not too bad. So we're gonna we're gonna mill the rest, yeah, and uh, hit the edges, and we're probably gonna match pair them uh, as far as their heights go uh, when we when we do the edges. All right. So, you guys, make sure you're watching Chris's channel. He does some good stuff. Good stuff. Yeah. He's got some old machines. Uh, yeah. I got a mill that's over 100 years old. Yeah. And my newest machine is 57, I think. 1957. <laughs> 1957, yeah. 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 Uh, we'll ignore the drill press. That's pretty so that's new. But that's years. Chinese made. 50, 57? It's, uh, I was born in 56, so that's 58 years. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, I found stuff. a contemporary for my equipment then. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> old stuff, old stuff. Uh, <laughs> All right, you guys, we're going to back to milling here. We got a lot to do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to start milling away on this casting. Yeah, Randy, a little bit of a sandstorm going on over here. Yeah. <laughs> no sand, we don't want sand. <laughs> You already got it kind of squared up pretty pretty well yeah. now. Yeah. The best we could. Well, I hope so before you start cutting metal off. Right? The best we could. <laughs> You really replace that. I need to replace that push button on here. Yeah. Bump contacts. And <laughs> if I come back and then you know, we, we kind of keep our chips uh, going that way. Oh, that's a good idea. You know, it just takes a time. You're your extra traverse. Of, yeah, yeah. You know, but it's a good thing they're not paying us for this job, huh? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we would do that every time if they're paying us. <laughs> oh. Oh, you're one of them guys, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Union machinist, huh? <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> Good thing I don't see any blowholes in no, it. Though. That's good. Yeah. This one's we're getting look, better. This one's looking a lot better than the last one. <laughs> get some iron in your diet. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think that's how you're supposed to get in. <laughs> Where it's hard on the teeth. <laughs> yeah. pretty it's going to be a little ding in the edge you know well that one's yours right no <laughs> no I'm, I'm just no. kidding with you no i would I, <laughs> I would i'd just go along here and chamfer it <laughs> yeah that's probably what i was going to do anyway so like you say that's uh i'm not going to need i'm not going to measure anything square like a yeah. squaring up my quarters or something there on that on that yeah. edge <laughs> that looks pretty good. I, don't, I don't see anything what do you think oh that one good yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, it looks pretty. Yeah. Take that dang thing off. Yeah. Yeah, I don't see nothing there. So we uh, flipped it over here. We took our aluminum rods out, and we're just flip with a milled surface or one milled surface <laughs> uh, up against the block. <laughs> uh, the, this ankle plate now, and uh, we check it with levels to see if it's close. Uh, it only took us about it. three times to come up with the right setup here too. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But this is working actually. It's working really well. The jacks uh, give us a uh, give us some tension, and uh, this is actually working really good. Yeah, we're not getting any. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to make myself some of them. Not, not getting any vibration or anything. yeah, yeah. Yeah, having stuff that uh, bolts to the table. Uh, it's, these are kind of big. Yeah, they're for taller things, but mm -hmm. they uh, they do work. Okay, you're gonna do this one. I'm going to do this one. You want to do this one? Oh, I oh, guess, wow. sure. All right. All right. Still clearing over here, huh? Yeah, so, you know, table up and down. So, uh, that's forward. Uh, my tape label came off. Forward, that's where, we, where we're, where we're running. Uh -huh. the middle is off. The beep, the sound you hear is the brake breaking. Mm -hmm. And this is reverse. Emergency stop if you have to. I hope not. <laughs> I've never used it, so yeah. <laughs> I put it in, but I never. It's used probably it. going to be over before you could hit that anyway. Whatever's going on. Yeah, it's on. usually broken right away. Yeah. <laughs> you just like, ah, they're spinning. <laughs> so, <laughs> stub but, uh, is spinning in the air. Yeah. So uh, it, this is going to be a little bit higher out here, right? We should touch off out there. You think or no? Yeah, that that's the way it's been. Yeah. Yeah, probably ought to touch out there. All right. That, that's it's, it's been that way. So. Okay. And about how much are you taking each cut? Well, I'm trying to keep it. Uh, well, I did 25 on that other one uh, as uh, like the max. I mm -hmm. think that 25 is plenty. Okay. The, just to, so we don't have vibration or yeah, you yeah. know cutting nice. hard. That way we can hit our seven tenths again, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. You know, light cuts make a yeah, yeah make a big difference. Yeah. I did. I mean, this this is the, that was a twenty thousandths finish cut though. Mm -hmm. That was seemed to be fine. Where yeah. the other one we did like ten thousandths. Mm -hmm. So. Well, like you were saying earlier, sometimes it seems like it cuts better if it's a little more, got a little bit more little, in the cut. A little yeah. more to bite, you know, so. All right. Go for it. So that way is forward, you said? Yeah, that way is forward. All right. Yeah, Unless you, for you. <laughs> beginner's luck, right?
I keep throwing the lever the wrong way, wanting the cutter to move, but that ain't gonna go nowhere. Well, yeah. <laughs> the table's what moves, not the cutter. Right, yeah. <laughs> I find it's easier to think about the table moving. Yeah, yeah. Get it? it looks a little funny, but I don't yeah, feel nothing there. <laughs> no. Yeah, it's just. Really. Otherwise, it might just be the hatching. I mean, the, the swirl. Yeah. You know. Yeah. I don't see any. Uh, right here, there's a couple. You know what? Uh, the, right here. Yeah. yeah. I'm not too worried about that's the stuff that, well, down that's in there. That, that's, that's that one yeah. spot. There's a couple of tiny ones showing here. Take take a light cut, maybe take a take a ten thousandths cut and yeah, yeah. You know, do do one more pass, but do it do it real light. Yeah, all right. Yeah. You know. Yeah, it's just, just in this area, did it each time in the same area. Mm. Oh, yeah. That's strange. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't know why. Oh, yeah, it feels really good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it, I can huh. feel a little. I mean, like it's kind of a little right here, But it's just it's huh. because of this. I don't know if the metal's a little different or what. Yeah, well, they use all kinds of scrap and stuff, so oh, I mean, you may end up with some weird. Yeah. I mean. But, you know, I'm not sure how, how the whole process works, uh, but it is cast iron when it's done, but it, maybe it might have a, just a little variation in it. A little, it. Uh, little emery paper on the plate. Yeah, thing. yeah a little lapping. And, and uh, you know, it's going to be just fine. Yeah. Just that one there. That, we'd have to take off quite a bit to get that out. Yeah, I'm not. It's right on the corner. You're not going to do much at the corner there, so. Probably about, I don't know. Oh, that's metal right there. Yeah. That's not sand. But to get it all out. Yeah, you're going to take a lot off of it for that. I don't know, 30. Maybe 30,000. 40,000. Like you said, I just would take a. Yeah. <laughs> yeah just put a little chamfer on just, there. Just chamfer it yeah. off, you know. Heck, you know, that one. You know. Yeah. I think we're good. All right. We're just going to go make a couple more of these now, then. So. <laughs> okay, guys. So we're going we're gonna to mill off the top here, and then we're going to switch it around, and we're going to do these other edges down here, too. Ready? Yeah. All right. Kind of good throwing the chips that way, anyhow. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, my camera. Huh? <laughs> well, I don't think it's blowing them out there, is it? Oh uh, yeah. A little bit. That's all right though. Like I say, it's just it's sealed up good in there. You can throw that thing in a pool ten feet right now if you wanted to. Yeah, but. Yeah, that came out real good. All right. Let's flip it around, huh? <laughs>
since yeah. we know this, this is the short side. Yeah. What was it measuring there? Maybe we About can actually that. hit some kind of a logical number here. Oh, four, four, nine, four, nine, thirty-five, roughly. So. Yeah. Take off 35 and you'd be right there at 49, you know, pretty close. Uh, well, uh, let's just go 25 and see. I had a, a hard spot to measure against. Yeah. Where's your little, your little uh, round bar? No, let me put something on there. Yeah. No, we, we here. We'll be, uh, oh yeah. That might be. Uh, to get the middle one all yeah, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. I'm sure getting really small either way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got the middle one, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's yeah. a little bit. A little right tiny there. speck right there. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that's what the deburring tool is for. There you go. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. You want to do the paper trick? We can do the paper trick. That gives uh, us, that gives I think we'll probably be okay. Yeah, I don't know if I'm really ever going to use that for a reference surface anyway. But I wouldn't yeah. use it for that kind of yeah. critical reference yeah. surface, but uh, that critical one. But I guess we could turn this part on, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just do a real light touch and take take forty. Take forty. We can measure it. Uh huh. Oh, there it is. Yeah. And then, like I said, do 25, and then we'll just then we'll set for a final cut. Oh, that's there. almost a zero right there, so. Oh, we moved everything back that way, so. I got to plunge a little bit. I just hear it plunging into the edge there a little bit. It's like moving. What's we're not we're not centered. Did we did we move the table? Yeah, I don't think we ever tightened these That's, bolts. <laughs> but what moved? That one's not tight. Yeah, man, whose job was that? <laughs> oh, nothing's tight. Huh? Those are tight. I tightened those, and I think I forgot the other ones. Hey, that's a bad idea. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, hell, that ain't tight either. That was tight either. Yeah. I didn't have the wrench. We learned a lesson from that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Holy moly. Yeah. Somewhere there. I, I think know. that'll still get it. <laughs> All right, well, let's try it again. Yeah. Uh, that's okay. So, so what happens when we get to talking, huh? No, okay, yeah. Uh, no, you're right. <laughs> so add another couple. Make sure you touch. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay.
67 and a half. 67 and a half? <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> All righty. I think that's plenty close enough. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Ah. So while we're on the subject of castings, uh, this is my next project right here. I'll give you a guess what that is. All right. But this is going to be my project for uh, Emma's tool making competition. So uh, make sure you check out her uh, video. I'll put it down here in a link at the bottom. And uh, if you want to make sure and see this, click on the, uh, the old horizontal mill and that will get you subscribed.